God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria. You may please be seated. Thank you. The Kaduna Investment and Economic Summit is an annual event introduced in 2016 by the present administration the to highlight the potentials of the economy of the state and attract investors to the state. Welcome once again to Cardinvest 7.0. The summit. With the theme, Building a Resilient Economy, this year's summit, which is the seventh in its series, brings together heads of government agencies, captains of industry, businessmen, traditional rulers and politicians, including the presidential candidate of the ruling All Progressives Congress. Since inception, the state government has attracted a total investment portfolio of about $4.4 billion in actual and announced investments, with 75,000 direct and indirect jobs also created within the same period. Governor Nasser El Rufai gives a recap of the economic summit and also highlights some of the gains recorded so far. We wanted a state where there are abundant economic opportunities and prosperity, social inclusion, peace and security, good governance and improved quality of life of the citizenry. We've tried to do that in the last seven years. We have succeeded in some areas, we haven't succeeded in some, and we hope that Senator Obasani's government will continue in that direction. In his address, the former governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Mohamed Sanusi, attributes the dwindling support from the federal government to states to poor financial management and policy somersault, adding that states must find ways to free themselves. But more generally, I think states need to free themselves of federal dominance. You have to free yourselves of dominate, of relying on the federal government. Just assume, just assume that you're not going to get help from the center. Okay, build your infrastructure, as the Kaduna State Governor said, build your own power supply, attract your own investors, educate your children, create your own jobs. The presidential candidate of the All Progressives Congress in the 2023 election, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, shares his thoughts on how to create the enabling environment for states to maximize their potentials, while the Minister of Industry, Trade and Investment, who represented President Muhammadu Buhari, commends the Kaduna State Government for attracting local and foreign investors into the state. I am particularly happy to be an in an economic summit as such as this, it reminds me when I started as the governor of Lagos, the Hingbeti summit more than 20 years ago. Nigeria needs it. As soon as 2023 is done, we're still going to have summits to make governance easy for thinking and doing. The success of subnationals in attracting investments, creating jobs and increasing their internally generated revenue is critical to the success of the entire country. I'm therefore impressed that the Kaduna State Government has from inception used CADINVEST as a veritable platform for showcasing its investment potentials. Justifying the theme of CADINVEST 7.0, which is building a resilient economy, Governor Nasser El Rufai and other speakers here are of the same view that it has become necessary for governments to be innovative, especially in the wake of the global economic slowdown, and to sustain reforms into the next administration.